I get that stuff later. So my eye look is I just used the palette. Like I just showed you guys in my last video. So if you didn't see that video before this one, go check that out. So yeah, that's what I have on my eyes. Um, earrings from Jode. I got this for my sister, um, Chiffon. It's get the changes. So yeah, you guys, I am sundress ready. But I'm trying to get there anyway. That's what I've been doing to you guys all week. Um, like I said, I've been working out more and more. So I'm back to working out five days a week. And like I said, I couldn't keep a hairstyle with that. So that's, you know, that's why I decided to just cut it all off. Because, you know, when I hurt my heel, you know, it slowed me down a little bit. So I'm pumping it back up again. Your girl getting sundress ready. So you guys, you don't, you know, you, it's not too late to join in on the weight loss challenge. I'm going to call it a lifestyle because it's a lifestyle challenge. So, yeah, I've been going hard in the gym. Um, I, I wasn't going to say anything, but I'm just going to go ahead and talk about it a little bit because I realized with me, I just dwell and dwell on stuff. But once I talk about it and get it out of my system, I I will, like, forget about it sort of and I feel better. But you guys, I've been here, like I said, all week in a funky-ass mood, in a bad mood. Because the post office, you know, my new subscribers, and I just retired from the post office, and they still giving me the blues. I need two drinks on it. Hold on. Yeah, y'all. They still giving me the blues. Um, you know, I had re applied for retirement like eight months before they approved it. So, of course, that meant back pay, you know. So, they gave me some money, whatever. So, what to do to do, you know, I'm paying bills off. You know, we travel, did vacation. I did a bid. And they, they start sending me bills in the mail. I'm like, why are you sending me these bills? I don't understand what's going on. I had been talking to people for months about this, and one guy said, oh, you don't owe that money, don't worry about it. But they kept sending me bills. And I'm like, what? You know, I'm just throwing them in the garbage. Some told me to go ahead and call and see what's going on. And, of course, with the government, it took, shit, about seven people I had to go through. But somebody finally told me that what had happened was, when they gave me that lump sum of money when I retired, you know, when it was approved, they gave me a lump sum of money. They paid me too much. This is my much love look. Yeah. So y'all already know what the hell that meant. You paid me too much money, send me a bill in the mail and say, I want my money back in 10 days. Ten days? What? How? Who? What? When? So yeah. So I had to call on that and make payment arrangements because your girl, that money is fucking gone, boo boo. Yeah. So y'all been in the in the dumps about that and it is a lot of money, you guys. I'm paying a couple of hundred dollars back a month. Y'all know I'ma keep it real. I'ma keep it real. Yeah. But but the, another thing, like I said, I'm, I'm talking about it because I I just realized a couple of hours ago. God is good because at least I can afford to pay it back. Even, even with all of the bills me and my husband have, I still can afford to pay them a couple of hundred dollars back a month. I don't want to. You know, we stuck with my travel money and my hard money, but I'm going to pay it back and I'll be through with it soon. So, yeah, that, that, that pissed me off. And I'm trying, you know, I don't even know if I even owe them money because they was like, you know, we paid you for pay period three, four. I don't know that post office lingo no more. I'm out of there. I don't know all about all that. So I just said payment. I just, I just say I pay it back, whatever. But yeah, you guys, that's what's been going on with me. Watching my time. So, yeah. So, um, I got a few minutes. So, um, just want to come in and say how you doing, how you been, how your mama and them doing and yeah, check out my little waves and ripples, whatever I got going on. And to say I love you all. Special shout out to Cutie Twenty One Able, one of my loyal um, YouTube family members. I'm gonna put it like I'm gonna put it like that. Shout out to you, boo. Jonathan, of course, with your crazy ass, with that long ass knife. Y'all go see that mama cutie. That boy is crazy. 